hey guys what's up with me i've got a micromax u eureka and in this video i'll gonna be test whether this device heats or not so this video comprises of two sections the first part comprises of playing nfs most wanted for five continuous minutes and then i'll be checking the temperature with the help of this cpu temperature help uh, app uh, also i'll record the time with the help of this top watch right over here and I decided to play NFS Most Wanted instead of Asphalt 8 because I want to stress the GPU of this phone to its maximum. So I'll be playing NFS Most Wanted at maximum graphics. The second part of this video comprises of playing a full HD video for 5 continuous minutes. Again 5 minutes, I'll be recording time with this top watch obviously. And uh, after that also I'll, I'll, uh, I'll be checking the temperature with the help of this CPU temp app again. And also do note that the Eureka is connected to Wi-Fi and also it is at maximum brightness level. So without any further delays, let's get started. I'll start the timer when the race starts. Timer started. So it has been 5 minutes, so now let's take a look at the temperature. It is 59 degrees celsius. Uh, average was 58 degrees celsius. It's not focusing. And no, I don't feel much warmth over here. It's it's quite average. And being an Octaco chipset, it definitely will warm up this much. So let me reset the time. Volume is full, brightness is maximum. Let's start the time. So it has been 5 minutes of continuous playing of full HD video. So now 61 degree Celsius. Analyze. Um, I can't find it, find it there but it was the highest at 61 degree Celsius. And do note that this is the CPU temperature. So this is the CPU temperature not the outer temperature. So the outer temperature is much lower than that 61 degrees celsius so 
Eureka does uh, Eureka do tend to heat up while extended gaming and while playing uh, playing or uh, and while pl- uh, watching full HD videos for for an extended time but the heat is tolerable it's good enough so to all those people who were saying not to buy Eureka because of heating issues uh, I think that this result will show them that Eureka does not heat that much as much as they think about it and also when this device will get lollipop update the snapdragon 615 chipset will make full use of its 64 bit uh, powers so the heating issues will get resolved I mean heating will get reduced with the lollipop update so I hope you guys like this video so thank you guys for watching and I hope to see you guys in my next one peace out there